This is one of the reasons why you can go into any market, whether it's something as competitive as weight loss or as obscure as beta fish, and you can set up a silent sales machine that's going to generate traffic and income for you. So let's go ahead now and look at the money word matrix. You can literally plug any keyword into the matrix and see whether or not it falls under the category of being a money word. And here it is. This is the matrix that we've developed through a ton of trial and error and testing to figure out what makes a good keyword. This is the result that you're looking at right here. Yes, it's simple, but like most things that work really well, it's simple. So if we look over here on the left, we have the number of monthly searches. So 0 to 499, 500 to 999, and 1,000 plus. If we look up here at the top, this is number of search engine results. And I'm going to show you what this is in a sec. We got 0 to 10,000, 10 to 20, 20 to 50, and 50,000 plus. And then you just match up the two and find out where the keyword falls into. Of course, we want to find keywords that fall here, 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 or here, and avoid the ones that fall in the poor and fair categories. Fair only if there's no good or excellent keywords. So let's open up a browser now and go over to Google and I want to show you what I mean by results. If I type in dog training here's what we're looking at. You'll see that the results here are 1 through 10 of 9,120,000. This is saying that there's 9,120,000 web pages out there that are essentially competing for this keyword dog training. So if we were to plug this into the matrix we'd go back and there's 9 million, so it's way, way up here. And we would then need to go look at search volume, and then we would be able to see where it falls. So let's do some real world keyword research and take a look at how this works. I'm going to open up my browser here, and I'm at the Google Keyword Tool. This is a free keyword tool that you can use. I'm going to scroll down a bit, and I'm just going to type in a niche that I've been looking at recently, which is saltwater aquariums. So I'm going to type in saltwater aquarium, click Get Keyword Ideas. And this is the hobby, saltwater aquarium keeping, actually having an aquarium in your home. That's what I'm kind of researching building a niche site about. So I've clicked keyword ideas, and Google should go to work looking for the results. And it'll pull up a list of keyword variations below here. Now what you want to do is click here on the search volume link to sort by search volume first. So I'm going to click there. And that's going to give me search volume in descending amounts here. So now what we can do is use the money word matrix to pick out the keywords that we want to target first. And the reason we want to target our money words first is because we want to get traffic to our site as quickly as possible. So we start out by targeting the money words first, and then progressively, after the money words have run out, and it's going to take a while before you run out, usually in most markets, then you can start targeting some of the more competitive keywords if you want. But for now, we want to target money words that are easy to rank for. So let's just start out. And let's see where Saltwater Aquarium falls within the Money Word Matrix. It gets 49,000 searches per month. That was in December. Let's type it into Google and see what the results are. Now, here's this is a very important point. When you type in your keyword into the search engines, be sure to put quotes around it. I'm not going to explain why right now. Just be sure to do it. Otherwise, the Money Word Matrix won't function the way it's supposed to. So the keyword is Saltwater Aquarium. We've typed it into Google. We can see that it's 584,000 resulting pages and 49,500 in search volume. So if we go back to the matrix, search volume falls way outside and resulting pages falls way outside. So this is a poor keyword. It doesn't even fit into the matrix at all. So let's go back. Let's try saltwater aquarium fish. I'm going to copy that one, paste it into Google. All right, this is 130,000 on the results. We go back to the matrix. This doesn't even fall within the matrix. So we're going back. Saltwater fish aquariums. Let's try that one. Now this one looks interesting. 12,100 competing web pages. That's actually pretty low. And the search volume we have here is 4,400 searches a month. So if we go back to the money word tool, it's here in this box. It actually falls outside this box, but that's okay. And it falls in this category. So this is a good keyword. This is a keyword that you want to target that you're going to get ranked for fairly easily. There's only 12,000 competing web pages, and chances are most of these guys, I'd say 99% of them, don't really know what you know about SEO and what you will know. So you can quickly skip, jump the line, skip ahead with some minimal effort, and get ranked for this keyword. And you're going to be able to harness 
benefit from the search volume that comes from this keyword, which at this point is nearing uh, 5,000 searches a month. That's a lot of search volume for one keyword. Let's go now and look at saltwater aquarium supplies, which gets 2,400. We type this into uh, Google. And it looks like this one actually has quite high search competing pages. Let's check out saltwater aquarium how to. Okay, this is a great keyword. Only 19 or 1900 search volume, only 1500 competing pages. This is a really easy keyword to rank for. Really easy. Let's check out one more. Let's check out saltwater aquarium setup. This one here. 1300 searches a month. Go into Google. And only 6000 competing web pages. So, this keyword, 6000 falls into this category and 1300 search volume which falls here so this is an excellent keyword so we found one good and two excellence just by doing a little bit of preliminary research what most people do the reason that this works so well is most people will sort by search volume and then they'll just start targeting keywords kind of randomly they'll move down the search volume list here picking out keywords as they go what you want to do is be more methodical and use the matrix to target those money words first so the big question becomes, once you know what your money words are, how do we get ranked for them? How do we get our site ranked? Well, you remember back earlier in the video I talked about the fact that we're building content sites here. Well, what you want to do is, you want to do basic article marketing for your content site. And I'm not going to go into the specifics of article marketing now, there's just not time in this video. But what you want to use is what I call the 21 day traffic blueprint. We implement this on every single one of our sites and we've never ever failed to see results. The 21 day traffic blueprint is simply article marketing. You build your content site, you add your articles, you decide what keywords you're going to target for each article, and then you go out and you distribute a second set of articles to article directories. And what happens then is those article directories give you links pointing back to your web pages, and those links contain the key phrase that you're targeting. If this all sounds a little bit complicated, don't worry. We go through it in step by step screenshot training uh, in the Niche Marketing 2.0 video course, Niche Profit Classroom. But what this does when you implement this is it super glues your site to Google. It really super glues your pages to the top of the search engines and they don't really budge again because there's no competition. There's nobody there to kick you out. I want to highlight that this is not the long tail method because money words have good search volume. And when you do implement this whole thing correctly, you should be getting a really, really solid stream of traffic. You can also continue to increase your traffic just by targeting more money words. So anytime that you want to add another boost of traffic to your site, you simply add an article to your site, you do a little bit of article marketing, and you get more traffic coming in. If you already have a website now and you're not getting all the search engine traffic that you want, implement this technique now because it's going to work. It's worked every single time that we've done it and it's worked for everybody who we've taught it to who has actually implemented it the way that we show them how to. So in the next video what we're going to do is we're going to show you how to take this free traffic that you're getting and how to turn it into fast easy automated cash. I'm going to show you one specific technique for doing this. The technique takes just a few hours to implement. You can do it on any website that you want and it's going to result in, again, easy, automated cash that truly comes in on autopilot. If you can't wait to learn the technique, go ahead and click the link on the right to go check out nicheprofitclassroom.com and the training, tools, and coaching that's offered there. Otherwise, we'll be in touch soon with the next video showing you how to turn your traffic into cash. I'll see you there.